Ruprecht to desire your brother. No sudden moves. The combination of the story and, of course, Steve Martin's timing and Michael Caine working off of Steve uh, was hilarious. So the only thing about the editing that you had to do was to figure out how long you should hold each moment and get out when you should. So the question of, in a sequence like this, a comedy sequence like this, you really, you don't want to overplay your hand, you don't want to stay too long, but you want to give every like portion of what's funny to let the audience uh, uh, sort of digest it. So that's the challenge of a scene like this. And also sometimes the challenge is when you go to the comic part of that scene. You've been banging on your pots again, haven't you? I told you, if you keep on doing it, you won't have any pots left. <laughs> <laughs> All right. There you have the true genius of uh, Steve Martin, and um, the only the only uh, editing problem was when and how you go to the other people in the scene to show the proper horror or disgust on their faces, and and that makes the scene even funnier. You know, for for whatever reason, this stuff went together really easily because. I suppose you can't really screw something like this up, but you can enhance it, and you can, you know, do the uh, make it as good as it can be. Ruprecht. Interestingly enough, when he leaps out from behind that barrier, uh, originally that scene went on longer. He actually climbed on top of her, and he did the same kind of thing he did with M Michael Caine where he threw his leg over her and she was screaming and Frank said to us, uh, you know, I think we should take out the glove. And all the women in the cutting room said, no, you have to take out that part where he climbs on top of her. And so um, he listened to them and he took out that but part. But that, that is such a hilarious part of that sequence. It's well, like, you ch it's a total cheat, there's right. no logic, but the, but the, um, timing of the way you cut it and the way he goes flying the uh what does he say the, the cuff the, the general little cuff. And, and you don't even think about it because because of the the editing right. is so on on spot you know i mean a lot of times there are certain instances where you can't really excise something or you can but it, it's it's glaring in this in this case it just uh you know it, it's strictly an accident when that happens when you can take something out and, and have it be, uh, and have it enhance the scene rather than, you know, just get away with it. In this case, it actually made the scene better.